Welcome back to another 7-Minute Review with me, P the Critic. Today we're taking a look at the DeLonghi La Specialista Prestigio. And it's a pretty good machine. Uh, I'm going to go over some of the uh, features and what it does. And I'll tell you that it hasn't been our favorite coffee maker. Uh, but stay tuned, it definitely has its place for, uh, for some users and others probably like us, won't find it as one of their favorites. The DeLonghi is unique in the sense that for this price point, it offers a dual boiler machine. What does that mean? The dual boilers basically means there's a dedicated boiler for the milk and, or for the milk steaming, I should say, and another boiler that pulls the shot. This machine, even though it's a dual boiler, does not allow you to do the milk steaming at the same time as pulling your espresso shot. So while many dual boiler machines allow you to do that, this one does not. But again, at a price point of $8.99, it's probably one of, one of the least expensive dual boiler machines you'll find. Again, the benefit here is that you can pull your shot and then go straight to your milk steaming right afterwards or vice versa. The DeLonghi La Specialista has a few different drink options that it offers. It does have an espresso setting, it does have an Americano setting, and as well it has a coffee setting. The coffee setting is kind of analogous to a Lungo, so it'll give you a little bit of a longer shot of your espresso and you can do single and double shot options in all of those. The Americano settings will pull the shot and then it will dispense the water for you as well. And of course the espresso setting is the espresso shot, it'll pull your espresso shot for you. As far as the milk steaming, you have a knob here. You turn the knob, that will go ahead and allow you to steam your milk. How this machine works, you let it know if you're making a single or a double shot, so it'll dose a single amount or double amount. You put your portafilter in, turn it, click it into place. It will automatically dispense the uh, grinds for you. It'll grind the beans for you. And once it's done that, you have this here, which will tamp for you. And so it's really mess free. It's, it's really nice in that everything is contained in that unit. Um, you're not gonna have a big mess like you do with a lot of espresso machines in general where you're grinding your beans and taking out your portafilter, you're tamping the uh, grinds and that can tend to get messy. This is uh, pretty much no mess. It's, it's really great in doing that. Let's go ahead and make a couple drinks and see how everything works. So the smart tamping station, I'm gonna insert our portafilter. We have the 2x selected here. I have my temperature at the medium level and I have my dose level as well. So I've let the machine know about what dose I want. Turn it into place. I'm going to tamp with the smart tamping lever. I'll usually do it twice. And it actually does a really good job of giving a nice flat puck. So it, it does a good job with that. It's got a little line indicating how much grinds to have. We're like slightly short of that line exactly, but this is a, a pretty good amount. Um, we found that this is a pretty decent tasting cup and shot. It's a pretty nice looking shot, if I can get it out. Um, a decent amount of crema. The taste is pretty good. Uh, the results are okay. I would like to be able to make better espresso shots if I could. So now we're gonna make an Americano and uh, see how that turns out. So I'm just gonna change this dial to Americano. We'll put a bigger cup in there and see what that looks like. Good amount, a good size. Fit right into our glass mug here. Let's see how that tastes. So this was my first time making an Americano on this machine. And we're at the medium setting as far as heat, which is how hot the, uh, the espresso shot is. That is very hot. Um, yeah, that was very hot. I uh, kind of burned my mouth a little bit. So. It definitely makes your Americano very hot, which is great. Um, except for when you're not really expecting it to be that hot, I guess. Um, but this is good. This is pretty smooth. It's good. Um, I feel like as I'm doing this review, I'm liking this machine a little bit more than I have liked it. 
Lastly, let's make a latte. So again, this machine has a manual steam wand. It's a pretty nice steam wand. It's rather powerful. Um, I, I wouldn't say it's super powerful. Definitely not a uh, commercial grade or anything like that. So let's steam our milk. Definitely not my best work, it's okay. Um, but this is not bad, let's see what that tastes like. That's pretty good, pretty smooth. Um, it's actually a pretty good taste. I'm telling you, the more <laughs> I'm in this review, reviewing this unit, the more I'm actually liking it. So if you're comfortable having pretty good shots and you don't think you're going to want to really start fine tuning and getting down to what you uh, really want to tune your espresso shots to, this is probably a great machine for you. Dual boilers are great. If you're okay doing uh, manual steam or manual milk frothing and uh, steaming, then great. That's another point here is that if you have multiple people in the home that are going to use the espresso machine, you might have the espresso or coffee connoisseur that you know is like an at-home barista and is okay with doing manual steaming and pouring the shots and trying to dial things in although you're limited to what you can dial in here um, so that person might enjoy this machine but then if you have someone that wants a simple quick and um, easy to use machine that maybe is going to be almost as easy as using a capsule system but wants to use uh, fresh beans then this is going to be a harder machine. My wife hasn't used this steam wand once. She's been using our, uh, our milk frother from Nespresso and she hasn't been as happy with the results. So it's definitely designed uh, for certain clientele, for certain customers. We're not those customers. Maybe you are. I hope this review has helped you be able to decide if you are the right customer uh, for the DeLonghi La Specialista Prestigio. And if not, Hey, you're like us. This is not the right machine for us. But either way, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And we look forward to seeing you on our next 7-Minute Review.